Um, August was a was a, another solid month. It wasn't high. It wasn't low. It had 115 um, sales for the month, which is pretty well the same as what it was in 2000 uh, in 2012 and 2011. So an, another standard standard month. In August, the it was a, a typical it was a typical month with good sales between three and three fifty and the highest in, in that three and 325 mark um, was well up, well above um, the rest and the interesting thing was there was a small peak at around five to 550 um, which was which was quite noticeable and which takes into account sort of the housing in Bethlehem and, and Matu and the avenues so the um, there was that little spike at the end of it which is and positive for the buyers in that higher price range. How does the year compare to the previous year in terms of sales figures? Um, if you look at August to August and this year and, and last year, uh, we're about 10% up on sales. Um, that's an interesting stat because there were two very big months um, and they were March and May that um, were in there. The rest of the year was very much a solid year as last year was. Yeah, there's there's still plenty of purchases around in the market looking to buy, um, so that's that's a good thing. I think if you take that in, into the um, the spring summer period, that if normally we have more houses come onto the market through that period, so there should be a, a strengthening of numbers of sales can't see prices rising but certainly there'll be a, should be a, a strengthening of numbers of sales through this next period. And this extra sales are going to come from? The extra sales are going, they're going to come from uh, the purchases that are there looking and people coming on the new new houses onto the market. Do you expect to see more listings over the coming months? I do expect to see more listings coming through. Um, it's been a bit of a surprise over the year that there hasn't been more listings through the whole year with the number of purchases that there have been around. Um, so therefore you'd expect that if the purchases are there, there'll be sales, but it hasn't been that way this year. So there's been changes to the lending rules. How is that affecting the market? I think certainly if, if you've been pre-approved finance, you need to check with your banks. Um, it has affected it has affected the market, and that um, th- those that have been pre-approved have may have struggled to get finance. There was one specific one we had just the other day that they had pre-approval and came to buy in this changeover period and struggled to get finance, and it was a big fight for them to get the finance. So just be careful with that is what I would say. Um, just make sure you've got your finance, especially if you're going to go to an auction, make sure you've got your finance sorted out. Is that making it harder to sell a home? It will have an impact on the sale of the home. Um, it will mean that the buyers may not be able to buy as, as high as they want, and so therefore there will be a, a, a qualifying of the buyers there won't be so much leniency of where the buyers can go to. They will just have to buy based on finance. I think the buyers, if, you, if you're looking to buy at the moment, then and finance is a question, and you're going to be going to the banks, make sure you check out with the bank that under this new system that you can get the money that you want to get. So you are looking at houses in the right price range before you actually waste your time looking at houses. In Tauranga House prices haven't been going up and they've been quite stable. Some houses have sold really well, um, but as a whole, house prices have stayed stable in Tauranga. So will interest rate changes stop that or lower that? Um, that'll be a good question, it'll be yet to be seen. Uh, Bethlehem, is, is, Bethlehem stays as an as a area to live. Uh, that people want to be on the north side of on the north side of town. There, if if you're looking to sell, then I think now is a great time to be looking because there are people looking to buy. 
Um, also with the schools that are in Bethlehem, that over this next period that people are looking to change and move into school areas. So Bethlehem will be a popular destination where people will actually be looking to get into. So if you're looking at selling, you know, I would start thinking about it. Yeah, if you're looking to buy, if you're looking to buy in Bethlehem, just know what you want um, because it could be quite competitive as a buyer. Um, predictions for the next couple of months? No, I think that that it'll be status quo. I think it'll be just steady as she goes. And the prices, I can't see. There's there's nothing really generating prices increasing, um, and there are purchases still out there wanting to buy. So I think that there will be house movement over the next period. I think it'll be very similar to um, what we are having at the moment.